Hello. This week in chapel, we are going to be reflecting on what it means to celebrate our uniqueness as individuals and also to be an inclusive community. We're going to be reflecting particularly on Jesus' example of this, the way he modelled uh, an inclusive community by choosing 12 very different people to be his disciples. They were not alike, especially in their political persuasions. Matthew was a tax collector for the Romans. He supported their presence and their authority over the people of Israel, and he benefited from that role enormously. Simon, one of the other disciples, was a zealot, uh, a member of a secret group of rebels who organized sabotage attacks on the Romans. He used subterfuge to disrupt their plans and their processes. These two disciples were polar opposites, and we can only imagine the kind of arguments they had around the fire as they followed Jesus and discussed his teaching. But somehow, these two, and all the other disciples as well, found their way to friendship and collaboration without needing to nullify or neutralize who they were as individuals. Jesus had chosen them as different, unique, and individual followers because he wanted them to be a team who would embrace and include everyone. And if that's true for those disciples, it's true for each of us as well. He wants us to celebrate who we are as the unique individuals and to do the same for one another. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you that you deliberately chose people who were different to be your followers. You celebrated their uniqueness and treated each one with love and respect. Help us too to be the kind of community who do that exact same affirmation and celebration of each individual. Amen.